If you're a Gala Games holder, you have to watch this video because this is super, super important that you get your tokens in your control. I'm going to talk about why, because one of the major exchanges has just released some information that makes this even more pertinent. So introducing Gala V2, if you miss this, a new era for the Gala Games ecosystem is about to begin. On May 15th, Gala V2 will be airdropped one-to-one -to, -one to all Gala holders. What does this mean? This is not a new token. This is the same token, same tokenomics, same supply, one-to-one, -one, meaning if you have $5,000 in Gala on the original contract, which you hold still right now, you're going to get $5,000 airdrop to you in the same amount right to your wallet when the V2 drops out. But here's the thing. All these centralized exchanges have not fully come out and said they're going to be backing the airdrop. So with that being said, it is super, super important you listen to this right now because I recently got an email from Coinbase. You may have seen this. I want to make everybody aware because this is very, very important. So update regarding Gala trading. Here you go. We regularly monitor the assets on our exchange to ensure they meet our listing standards. Based on our most recent uh, reviews, Coinbase has moved our Gala USD order book to limit only mode and will suspend trading for Gala on May 12th, on or around 12 p.m. Eastern. Suspending trading. Trading will be suspended on Coinbase.com, Coinbase Pro, Coinbase Exchange, and Coinbase Prime. Your funds will remain accessible to you and will continue to have the ability to withdraw your funds at any time. However, on May 15th, they uh, had a typo here. On May 15th, 2023, Gala is issuing Gala V2 with a new contract address. Coinbase will not be supporting any airdrop. Let me repeat. Coinbase will not be supporting any airdrop of Gala V1 or V2. Coinbase will also not be facilitating any upgrade from Gala V2. Uh, from Gala V1 to Gala V2 at this time. Gala funds held in Coinbase. Sorry, guys. Gala funds held in Coinbase.com, Pro, Exchange, or Prime account before, at, or after the planned snapshot will not entitle you to receive any Gala V2 potential airdrops. So Coinbase is not going to support this move to V2. This is a major exchange. A ton of people hold their Gala there. So this is very, very crucial that you listen to this message and get your funds, when it comes to Gala, off of centralized exchanges. Of course, I want to make everybody aware because I do not want to see anybody lose out on their Gala tokens holding them on Coinbase. And who knows what other exchanges have done. I just saw this. wanted to make you aware of it because obviously we know how big Coinbase is. Now, before I let you go, I got something else important to bring you. This came out in late April. Just want to make sure you guys are aware of this. Jason uh, Brink, a.k.a. Bitbender, of course, president of blockchain at Gala Games, says this. Seeing a bit of misinformation and a good bit of disinformation on the Go Gala Games new contract for Gala. This isn't an additional token. It's an upgrade that replaces the old token altogether. It has a number of improvements, including better tracking of burns needed for bridges and play by burn security enhancements, increased decentralization, upgradability, so we don't have to do this again. Nothing is changing about the fundamental tokenomics, supply, etc. It's just a new contract with a new token going one-to-one -to, -one to the people who hold the old token, which will be then deprecated. So I think people got confused that this is a second token. It's just replacing the only token that's out there now. Appreciate you guys as always. Hopefully this helps. And again, if you're holding your Gala games on Coinbase, hopefully you saw this. If you if you think other people are not going to see this video, share it with them. Let them know. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.